Hello everyone, this is Deadeye. We're back with Mass Effect 3. There's this... What's this? Oh, okay. This has been bothering me. Edie, can you clean this up? I will try. Mr. Kodesh, we've lost barriers. Our comm system is jammed. Can anyone hear this? I'm, I'm hearing Get this. Get fighters incoming! Please, if anyone can hear this, we need help! We have all breaches! Oh, I got a warrant. Or an animal. Run. The Kinesh is Admiral. getting swarmed by Geth fighters. Damn it. Interceptors, divert to the Kinesh. Thank you, Commander. If you hadn't enhanced that signal, we'd have lost the ship. Really? That's what that was all about? Okay. Um. Let's talk to the Admiral. The Geth recovered faster than we'd hoped. If it hadn't warned us, they could have wiped us out. Hey, he has a name. It's Legion. Sounds like you owe Legion an apology. However advanced your friend is, it's still a Geth. A Geth who just saved your fleet. Yeah. And I wish I could have known it better. But right now, we cannot afford trust. What do you need? Uh... Which fleet does Admiral Zen command? Special projects. It's not a fleet, per se. Just a few research vessels. What's with the air quotes? Her technical breakthroughs have put us within striking distance of the home world. Apparently she's unstable. You're not worried about her losing perspective, given her interest in the Geth? If she can save our people, she can do whatever she wants. Okay. I'm, I'm not interested in your f details. I'll let you get fleet. back to work. Not at least not right now. Thank you, Commander. I want to go back to shooting things. Yeah, I'll talk to people later. Uh, we got two missions. One, we have to save some guy. And I forgot exactly what the other one was. Already. Um, Without the fleet, we lose our supply lines. Lose your supply lines, you lose the war every time. Every time. Right. Anyways. Commander, we've got reports of trouble at a Turian fuel depot on Sion. I've updated the galaxy map. Okay, well... Actually, yeah, let's go do that. I don't know where it is, but we'll do that, and then we'll come back and help the uh, Quarians. Yeah, you guys, you guys are fine. Where is that? Mission. Over here. That was... <laughs> it's pretty far away. Okay. And I think I'm going to take the old crew with me. We are uh, in Garrus. Alright. Shepard, about 72 hours ago, the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Right. Scans at the station are cold. It's deserted. What happened to the troop station there? I'm not interested uh, in the no, temperature. No fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. Right. Captain Riley's on site doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good hack it out. Good hack it? Good hack it. What Commander, the? Look Corporal how Nyrek stupid reporting. they're holding the Captain weapons. Riley is on point waiting for you. Ugh. Is it gonna be a new thing? Everyone's gonna hold weapons stupid like? How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. It's Carry on. <laughs> Apparently I'm not that interested. Treatment plan for chemical burns. This is pretty detailed. It's gonna make whoever happy we over at the Citadel. We need work around, soldier. On it, man. Captain Riley. Commander, it's an honor. Yeah. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Roger that. The fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Got it, Captain. Good work, Coslow. Good work, Coslow. 
We're facing an unknown enemy. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. Oop. <laughs> <laughs> apparently, apparently you don't do that. All right. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. I can't go there. I die. No. Radiation whoa. proximity warning, Commander. Avoid at all costs. Then what the hell do I do? Can't stop that. We're locked and loaded. Ready to move out. Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting access to most of the grid. Survival in hotspots, not possible. Alright, so where the fuck do I go? What? Oh, I must go around. That's what it is. Those are my people. Hey, no, I was trying to see if I'd be in there. Open it up. No. Uh -uh. Oh, yeah. It's moving me. Cool. Truly uh, stimulating. Watch out, we are. All right, is that it? I think that's it. I have a visual on the fuel rod control, but radiation is blocking access. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. Okay. What'll I do? <clears throat> Let's see if there's something over here. Doesn't look like there's anything over here. There we go. This looks like ventilation control. Should do the trick. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. Let's unlock those fuel rods. Yes, let's. Wait, data pad. Credits. Wonderful. Power is restored. System ready. Wait a minute. Captain, tracking movement in your areas. Defensive positions. Enemy inbound. We're ready for them. We're over here, apparently. Oh, I'm not going there. How am I supposed to help these people? Oh, there we go. I'll help the people by shooting the enemy in the head multiple times. No. Stop that. Moderator tank. Two tanks moving to seal. Can I go down here and not die? Tank one is sealed and stable. Patching seems to be working. Only one more to go here. Oh. Right. Did I see something over here? Oh, no. Okay, shut up. There. Wonderful. Riley, you in position? Affirmative. Awaiting your word. Hit the go button. Initiating restart. Commander, Captain, I'm reading a lot of movement. Headed your way. Incoming. Oh no. Progress. Round two. Here we go. 
No, stop with that. Hey, how'd you get behind us? That's a bruise. Join the battlefield. Oh, okay. apparently you will. Oh damn, I'm out of ammo. I like this gun, I just run out of ammo way too often with it. Oh, no, stop that healing thing. Stop it. Stop it. I'm not even using the... Uh... Fine. There you. There. There's a breaker. Oh! Yeah. Eat it. Oh, we got some full barrier. Oh, I don't like that. Come on. Where are my uh, two companions? do try out that new arc pistol come on where are you oh I like it, it feels good Commander, we're being overrun. the gun that is Uh, I'll help. Hold tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. Send uh, the the the. I don't care. Liara, get him to safety. Right away. Oh crap. Maybe I should have sent someone better, huh? Restart is complete. Reactor fully powered and operational, Commander. Probably no harm running through that Chloe thing. Oh. What's going on? Why couldn't you guys be raised on the car? Commander. You saved our asses. My team is in your debt. Oh, okay. Job well done. Report back to the shuttles. I was expecting something there. Just... No, just... No, it's a good job. Yeah. Good work down there, Shepard. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad yeah. it could help. 
I'll you know. keep you posted on new developments. Okay. Check it out. I was expecting a little more out of that, but whatever. Uh, that wasn't too long, so I think I'm gonna use some time here and talk to Tali. Hey, how you doing? I haven't heard any news about that Reaper base. Hopefully, they'll give us a target soon. Hopefully. How's it? How is it being back with the corner? How is it being back with the fleet? Right now, it's exhausting. I'm an admiral in the middle of a war. I just want us to get out of this alive. Everything else can wait. Can you join me? She's gonna say no. When this is over, I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. Yeah. If we survive this, we'll have a home world. My people need me. Yeah, of course. You could help your people's home world by fighting the Reapers. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not thinking that far ahead yet. So how did you end up back with your fleet, Tally? When the war started, the Admiralty Board asked for my help. I had more recent contact with the Geth than most of my people. They hadn't filled the spot on the board left by my father. I was invited in. Oh, okay. It's just a technicality. I'm far too young to be a real admiral. They give you f fake Don't admiralty? Don't short, Daddy. The board needed your expertise. You needed the authority that comes with rank. There you go. How did the war with the Geth get started anyway? Admiral Zen developed a scanning countermeasure that interferes with Geth active scans. It's like a flashbang grenade. It effectively crippled the Geth ships in combat. My fleet couldn't pass up the chance to attack. Hmm. Could we use it to fight the Reapers? It only works against the Geth, unfortunately. Their AI lets them use extremely detailed LADAR pings. Zen's countermeasure overwhelmed them with garbage data. And it's useless now that the Reapers have upgraded their processing power. Okay. Talk to you later, Tally. Nice talking to you, If Tally. you want to catch up in private, call me up to your cabin. Oh, okay. Maybe we should go do that. Yeah, I'm going to go run over to the cabin. All right, let's talk to Tally. Tally, I'm free if you'd like to come up. I'll just be a moment. <laughs> we were just talking a second ago, and I ran all the way up here. Thanks for asking me up. I couldn't talk freely in front of Ron. That's okay. You okay? No. No, I'm really not. Oh, 17 what happened? million lives are riding on me. And I don't know if I can save them. It's... Uh... You're doing everything you can. If the fleet falls, it won't be because of you. There you go. I helped my father and... And Zen's ideas? The new tech that made an invasion too good to pass up? That's based on my father's work. Uh, if they die because of me, if if I don't... It's not because of you. We'll get no. them out of there safely, Tally. Yeah. I couldn't do this without you, Shepard. I feel like I'm bluffing, trying to convince them that the Admiral's daughter knows what she's doing. Not the Admiral's daughter. The Admiral. I know. And at least now, I can push back against the worst ideas. That's why I accepted the position. And because of you. Me? When they offered me this position, I asked myself what you'd do. I thought you'd take the chance to make things better. Yeah, I do that, that a lot, don't I? probably sounds stupid. It's just, I know I'm not really qualified for this. You're doing fine, Tally. And thanks. I should get back before Careful the Admirals get into trouble again. I'll talk to you later. Okay. That was nice. Uh, oh, apparently I can uh, invite James up here. Um, okay, James. James, I've got some time if you want to talk privately. On my way. Hi, James. Hey, man, how's it going? Good, James. You? Good, good. Wow. So this is what I can look forward to when I get my own command. Prestigious, and then look at... Well, not you want your own ship, Vega? Yeah, maybe one day. Fancy. When That's I'm old and I can't fight worth shit anymore. <laughs> you just come up here to make fun of your commander? Sorry, loco. I guess maybe I got some things on my mind. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. What is that? Shoot. What did you do when they asked you to join the N7 program? 
I mean, was it a no-brainer for you, or did you think about it before accepting? Well, I kind of think about everything, so I thought about the it. The N7 program is a big deal, but it's also a big commitment. I hear that. You get the best training, best equipment, best assignments. And they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Why are you asking? Well, even all the shit that's going on, somebody somewhere managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. Oh. It's dated the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from the fact that there won't be an N7 program if we don't win this war, I just... Being a soldier is the only thing I've ever been really good at. And not because I try. Hell, I'd have kicked my ass out years ago. Last time I had a command, I lost almost everyone. And they promoted me for it. I guess I'm just not sure if I'm ready to lead again. I don't know if I want that responsibility. What happened exactly? You mentioned that before. What went wrong? What didn't go wrong? We were out on patrol, checking on some strange readings. Then the collectors hit. But they hit the colony first. By the time we got back, most of the colonists had been subdued or abducted, including our CO, Captain Tony. So you were in charge? Yeah. We laid low for a bit, waiting for a chance to strike. But before we could, we were betrayed. One of the colonists turned out to be a Cerberus spy working with the collectors. I had no choice. I killed him and destroyed the collectorship. But it got ugly. We lost most of the colonists and all but one of my squad. Not exactly a textbook operation. Yeah, you still got out, man. You can't blame yourself for being put in a tough situation. And if you were promoted, then something must have gone right. Sure, but... If you'd saved them all, would things have worked out better? I... I don't know. I don't think so. The right choice is usually not the easy one. Yeah. Did you know that before you joined the N7? Yeah. That's why I was asked. And it's why they asked you. There's not a single N7 that hasn't sacrificed, either themselves or their soldiers at some point. So you think I should accept? Well, hell yeah, but, I mean, you know, it's... Nah. Hell yeah. Assuming we survive this, that's a no-brainer. You're a damn good soldier, Vega. Don't waste that opportunity. I'll think about it. Seriously. If you don't mind, maybe don't mention this to anyone else. Of course not. Gracias. Well, yeah. I think I better get back to the hangar. Things here it's a little too soft for me. The bed's a lot harder than it looks. I'll take your word for it. Thanks again, loco. <laughs> Anytime. Oh, all right. Funny. Anyone else? Nope, no one else. All right, cool. I think uh, that'll be one video. And then uh, when we come back, I'll uh, go back do those Corrigan missions. You know, they need help. I, I need their help. So it's, you know, makes sense. I don't know what I'm saying. I'll see you all next time.